What's up guys my name is Mayank and today I'm at the Northeastern University campus so this is the university where I graduated from so I thought of making a video or a campus tour for you guys to know how it's like to study at Northeastern University and what all different academic blocks and facilities are there in this university and I have with me today Shikha Hi I graduated from Northeastern University in computer science in December 2017 And I graduated from Northeastern in 2018 August. We both are international students. We both came from India. We joined Northeastern in January 2016. So if you are planning to join Northeastern University or if you are considering Northeastern University for your bachelor's or master's then this video is for you. Also if you are curious to know or how a university looks like in United States then keep watching. Let's have a closer look at the campus. So guys this is kind of the center of the university and uh, the campus of Northeastern is uh, not exactly a gated or a walled campus it's mainly a campus which is along the streets uh, because it, this university is right in the heart of Boston very close to Boston downtown look uh, behind me back there so the glass building which you see right there is called Marina Center and uh, that's uh, for all the sports lovers if you are into any kind of sports then that's the place for you so you're going to spend a lot and lot of time at marina center for sure and if we go to the left of marina center then we have a lot of different uh, halls which we will go just in a bit and if you go on the right side of marina center on this way then uh, we have college of computer and information sciences and school of law right here so let's check out the school of law and college of computer sciences before we go on to the other side between school of law and ccis we have a stern center here all the career counseling and recruitment happens so we are inside the college of computer and information sciences which has been renamed to curry which has been renamed to curry college of computer sciences and right behind me is one of the labs of computer science department and then there are three more levels above it curry college of computer sciences has very strong co-op program and a lot of recruitment activities for computer science student happen in this building there are two campus tours which are happening right now behind me there and there actually there and there too There are these water fountains across the campus in each and every building very very accessible If security is your concern then campus security is top notch at Northeastern so if you see the police van right there there will be a lot of policemen deployed across the campus right on these big SUVs they are on bicycles and their bikes and everything So we just saw Cory College of Computer Sciences and before that we the law school and right now we are within the campus and if you look around so these are all the student halls where you have all the classrooms and uh, some of them are like resident halls as well now we are going to a place called Sentinel Common So this place is called Sentinel Common and this is the spot that of a student would be hanging around all the time no matter what part of the year it is. So on this side uh, we have Shilman Hall. Opposite to Shilman Hall there is another hall called Rider Hall and right in front of me is Berakis Health Science Center where again a lot of uh, classes happen for grad and undergrad students. And this is the mascot of Northeastern University, a husky. This guy is beautiful. Woo. 
North Eastern University officially manages a husky dog which is called the King Husky and that's because it's the mascot of North Eastern University. So if you ever happen to hang around the campus, you gotta meet the King Husky. This is so cool. You can get your own hammock and chill here all day long. So this is Sentinel Common and right beside Sentinel Common we have a train station or a tea station called Ruggles which is basically orange line and it goes all the way into downtown and so forth right. So if you ever want to catch a train it's within the campus. Let's check out the Ruggles tea station. Shuttle service offered by Northeastern Police Department. If you are an undergrad or grad student living off campus within a few miles of Northeastern campus, Red Eye drops you to your home free of cost. So the Red Eye service is really really useful if you are studying at the library late nights. So Red Eye usually starts from 7 pm in the night and it runs until very morning like 6 or 7 am. So now we are heading to the library also called the Snell library. Let's check out that place. That place is huge and has a very very nice seating for students. We are inside the Snell library now. Get in the library using your Husky card and if you're a new student, you go to Spheres Common to get your new Husky card. And what we have right now is our alumni card. So Northeastern University Snell library has four levels. You can talk and be at your best on level one and two and you can only whisper on level three and level four is like a dead silence zone. You just cannot utter a single word let's have a look at all the four levels they are really really cool they have a full range of seating arrangement starting with the very sofas to uh, individual working spaces and they also have these uh, small conference rooms where you can basically collaborate with other students and work on your projects or assignments together There's Argo tea if you're feeling sleepy or you want to have a bite inside the library. Argo tea is your place. This is one of the types of seating arrangement here. You can literally have your own personal space which you can cover and just sit inside. It's like a little den. Let's check out level 2, 3 and 4. On level 2, there are a lot of Apple monitors that you can connect your laptop to and there are a lot of group study rooms that you can book through your MyNEU portal. There are printers when you join the college they give you a credit per year and you can use that credit through your card to take the printouts. It's around $100 per year. You just have to swipe in your card on these printers. <laughs>
we just got out of Snell Library and if you are a fresh grad student or undergrad student coming to Northeastern University so you would be spending a lot and lot of your time at this place which is the Snell Library. Now we are walking towards the curry center to get some food. So curry center is the place where you also have the bookstore and the game room. The game room has uh, table tennis and, and a lot of video games. Curry Center has a lot of restaurants where you can grab a bite and you can always hang around here as well. The levels above it, there is a ballroom and then we have the game center. So we are sitting at this place called After Hours. A lot of uh, artists perform here live and it also has a Starbucks inside it. So this is level 1 of Curry Center. It has a really fancy seat. It also organizes a lot of college level events. On the level above it, which is level 2, you have the ballroom and on the third level we have the game room. So this was Northeastern University game room and we have table tennis, pool and a lot of video games here. These stairs connect to a huge parking lot which is dedicated only for students and faculty and they also connect to other buildings like science and engineering building and international village. So the hall right behind me is called L Hall and this has all the resources which an international student needs. So this has the OGS which is called Office of Global Services. We also have a huge auditorium. Last but not the least, we are going to the Marino Center which is a paradise for everyone who is into any kind of athletic activity. Let's go. Right behind me is the Northeastern University tea stop. So basically, Northeastern campus has two tea stops. One is Ruggles, the other one is this one. So this grocery store is called Wollaston's and there is a chain of Wollaston grocery stores across the campus and what you can get here is almost everything which you need on a day to day basis. Guys, so in a nutshell, Northeastern University has everything which you need on campus. It's starting from the grocery stores to coffee places. Obviously, one of the best library in town. I hope you guys found this video a little useful. Don't forget to leave the thumbs up and I'm gonna do a few more campus tours of uh, different universities. This is my Ranjan Dayal with Shika Singh. Over and out.